So now in this video we're going to look at uh, parallel resistors and the basic property of parallel resistors is that when you have uh, resistors in parallel you have an equivalent of less resistance than one of them alone. When they're equal values it's uh, very easy. Two equal value resistors you'll have a uh, half the equivalent resistance. You'll get twice the current flowing through a circuit. So a simple way to uh, test this out, we have the power supply there. 30 milliamps of current is uh, going through there. I'm powering it with 12 volts, uh, by the way. And I set it to a maximum of 35 milliamps in case I short something out or, or whatever. Um, but in uh, any case, we have uh, 10 milliamps going through this LED with just one protective resistor and uh, 20 milliamps of current going through that one. And we can... Uh, somewhat uh, prove that by pulling this resistor watch that LED it'll get dimmer uh, the resistor is hot and uh, now we're down to 20 milliamps of current we can come over here and uh, power that LED you can probably see it get brighter I'm purposely uh, making and breaking the connection there but uh, when we have the complete connection it's 30 milliamps of current and of course if I yank this one now we got uh, just 20 going through that one if I yank that one now we got 10 and of course 0 if I yank them both and back to the diagram, I have some numbers for those that like that. So, of the 12 volt power supply, this indicates a, a current measurement, but you don't actually have to take the measurement. It can just be for informational purposes. So, of 12 volts, about 2 volts is being dropped from a red LED. Remember, blue or green, some other colors will drop about 3, but uh, red drops about 2. Leaving 10 volts across, in this case, uh, one resistor there, which sets the current. 10 volts divided by 1,000 ohms equals 0 0.01 amps, which is 10 milliamps. Uh, you can take that uh, voltage and current and you multiply them together it's 0.1 watt which is close to half of a quarter watt which you don't want to exceed that's what they're usually rated for so instead of getting a half watt uh, 500 ohm resistor instead you can just put a couple 1 kilo ohm resistors in parallel that will double the current instead of using half the resistance because the red LED is still dropping 2 volts, but that 10 volts now is across both of these resistors. They're both passing current, and then where they combine, that current combines. And uh, you get 20 milliamps of current. 